the Demeter, out at sea with no land in sight. This story takes place on this merchant ship, the Demeter. We started our voyage doing the interiors of the ship in Berlin. It's a fantastic studio. We had one set, it was on rockers that went back and forth. <laughs> it was kind of getting seasick, but we're on the set. And then we had to shift this huge company of people to the island of Malta. It's the biggest ship that's ever been built in Malta. It's 180 feet long. But yeah, it's a huge achievement. And we have this infinity tank that looks out into the Mediterranean. And so they built the exterior of the ship in this tank. You want to give the cast the best performance opportunity they can, you know? And so to build it where you can see the water will, you know, help inform the performances and give you a much better movie. He's coming! It's got a massive barge just full of air tanks, which when we fill them with water and air at the same time, make the ship list from, from the port to starboard. Evil is on board. Powerful evil. I wanted the ship to feel dirty and real. It was built with old material to make sure that it felt grounded. Had all the ropes made, all the pulleys made, so it really is sort of endless detail. We had this whole set that we could make our playground, and that scale really does help in creating that world. May God have mercy on us all.